What's happening everyone? So in this video, part one, I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna mount a 21 inch Dell monitor to the face of this case using the VESA 100 mount, quick disconnect. Part two is going to be how I'm gonna mount a computer in here. A while ago I had to do some recording and I needed to edit it on the spot. When editing 406K video, you need something pretty powerful. So it's very beneficial to have a portable computer in some way other than a laptop because not all of them can handle 4 and 6K footage. So I opted to grab this Milwaukee case as I have other Milwaukee products. And I'm gonna jam a computer in this. This is how I'm gonna put the monitor on. So for step one, just get a flathead screwdriver and you can pry out each of these little tabs. So you're gonna to wanna to take your QD VESA mount. And center it on here. So now that we have it centered, it's funny that these four holes actually practically correspond with the mounting bracket that we have. Grab your trusty DeWalt drill bit out of your Milwaukee box. So it looks like a 530 second screw. So we went up a little bit, got a 1164 it's a bit. Get the old Milwaukee out. So the screws that came with it are too big to go into the holes. These smaller screws actually fit right in. They have a good amount of penetration. So we're gonna stack two washers instead of using the standoffs. So with our washers on there, put the plate down, get your screw, feed it in through the back. The washer on top, get your nut. So in my case, there's seven mil nuts. Make them wooden tight. So now we got the vase mount on here. Give this a test run. Pushing it on. Give it a little per persuasion. Fits like a glove. Get your monitor out. Take the screws out of your mount on the monitor. Throw your plate on. Could use the screws included with the monitor or screws included with the mount. Since it came with them all, I'm gonna use these. Just get them started a little bit. Torque these to Gooden tight. Slide that baby on in there. Observe the beauty you just created. And that's how I got the monitor into the case. 
Now the next step is to build a computer inside the case. That's part two. Either I'm gonna use this or I may opt to use the little ammo can or whatever they wanna call it these days. Cooler, love that box. It's awesome, very versatile. Tons of compartments inside, you got the tray. I am using it for my nail gun and some other stuff right now, but either I'll pick another one up or steal that one and use some of my other pack out stuff. But thanks for watching the video. Get that monitor in, get editing.